Imagine you're sending a package across the country. You'll probably choose a priority shipping to get it there fast, right? Well, the internet can work in a similar way. When you're streaming a movie, joining a video call, or downloading large files, you want the data to get to you quickly. That's where MPLS or multi-protocol label switching comes in. It acts like a priority wow. shipping service for your data, setting up fast and efficient routes to measure smooth delivery. Over the next few minutes, you'll know how MPLS makes internet data transfers faster wow. and more reliable. Normally, when data is sent over the internet, it takes a hopping journey moving from router to router until it reaches its destination. Each router it encounters makes a new decision on where to send it next, like a road trip where you choose your route at every destination or intersection. But just like in real life, too many stops mean more chances of delays. This can lead to network congestion, slowdowns, or even packet loss especially when there's a lot of traffic. MPLS steps in to resolve this problem by creating a more predictable direct route for the data, reducing these hops to avoid delays. It's like giving your data a pre-planned highway so it skips the busy streets and goes straight to where it needs to be. So how does MPLS make this fast direct path? It's all about labels. When data enters an MPLS network, it's assigned a specific label at the start of its journey. This label is like a ticket that shows exactly where the data is headed and the path it'll take. Every router along the way just reads the label and forwards the data on the fastest, most efficient route. Unlike traditional IP routing, where each router makes a new decision for every packet, MPLS lets routers follow a single preset path. It's like having a VIP ticket that skips every checkpoint along the way, speeding up the entire process. These labels are powerful tools for speeding up data, but they also make routing smarter. Think of each label as a shortcut when a data packet is assigned a label. They are programming its entire journey. Each router it passes doesn't need to analyze the entire packet, just the label. This label is read only by the router, which it forwards it along the most direct route. This method eliminates the data processing time, which is crucial for high speed data needs like video, conferencing, online gaming, and streaming. So in short, the label doesn't mean faster, it means the data arrives more reliably even during high traffic times. Now this label-based routing takes us to the next concept, the label switching path or LSP. Think of the LSP as high speed express lane for data. Once a packet is assigned a label and an LSP, it travels along this path without any unnecessary stops. These LSPs are predetermined by the network, which means that the data follows a direct streamlined route from start to finish. Fewer stops means fewer chances of delays and congestion, creating a smoother, more reliable journey of the data. So. In busy networks, this efficiency is crucial for maintaining speed and performance, especially for real-time activities. Now let's put it all together and compare MPLS to traditional routing. In traditional routing, data takes a more unpredictable route hopping from one decision point to next decision point. Think of it as driving through city traffic, lots of stops and starts, and potential slowdowns as well. MPLS though gives your data a direct predetermined path that's optimized for speed and reliability. It's like taking a freeway instead of winding to the streets. So a few decision points makes faster delivery and lower latency, making MPLS ideal for situations where every millisecond counts. Well, thanks for tuning in. If you want to learn more about networking and internet technologies and cybersecurity, make sure to subscribe and stay connected with us. And go ahead and share this video whom you think will really benefit from this. And until your next tech session, bye now.